Hi friends, welcome, welcome back to my channel. My name is Fiona and I'm a full-time artist. And on this channel, I like to take you with me on my artistic journey, whether that means working on projects here in my studio, going out to see cool art exhibits, buying art supplies and sharing my all with you, basically any art related content. So if that sounds like something you're into, please like and subscribe. It really helps me out. I thought I would just start this week's video with me beginning a new canvas. So I hope you enjoy it. Hey friends, I thought I would do a little studio vlog um, every month this year. That might be a little bit ambitious, I don't know. Um, but yeah, it's not off to a great start. <laughs> anyway, I, uh, I got a bit of a late start in January because I was working on um, like, well not working, honestly. <laughs> 
What am I even saying? Yes, so I got a late start in January because I took some time off around the new year and just sort of was resting and recharging. And um, I sort of jumped back into things. I started a painting and then I also had a meeting to discuss a mural that I will be working on in April, but we are just at the first initial stages, so uh, I do need to do sketches this week for that. Uh, my mom is coming over on Thursday so we can start some ceramics because I have a solo show going on locally in April, but then now as a part of the mural, uh, I've also been asked to exhibit some work and their interest in the ceramics. And then in May, I have other art fair Brooklyn. So. I need to get on top of making ceramics now so stuff will kind of be ready for then um and then what else zelda my arm's getting tired okay um what else and on top of yeah obviously doing ceramics i also need to do paintings and drawings since yeah there'll be that extra exhibition that i wasn't really expecting um so I'm, I'm not too worried about the solo show that's local. It's at a coffee shop. And I think I initially, they call it a residency actually, um, but it's just like a show in a local coffee shop. And when I first moved to the area and I went to this coffee shop, like the first week I moved here, I was like, oh, I see they have artists up there. And I inquired and they're like, yeah, your artwork's great if you're interested. We'll put you on the calendar and i said okay sounds good and now like two years later it's finally happening so yeah they have a booked calendar so um but now it's up and coming and obviously i want to do something nice since locally uh i'm not sure people know me so um i want to do that but it doesn't have to be like like I don't have to do like finalized framework. I don't think I could even do canvases. I think it's just gonna have to be works on paper because they have just a metal wall where you just magnetize things to it. So I think I'm gonna do something nice for it, but it's not like a high stress solo show exhibition thing, you know, just if, even I could probably use stuff I have. So um, I just have to look through my inventory and then see if I wanna make some new things. And then the other opportunity though, the newer one, since it's running in conjunction with the mural that people in town will see my mural and then they will be referenced to the um, Arts Council where they can go see more of my work. Um, it's a bit of a bigger deal. So uh, since that's new, I definitely wanna make some work for that. And then obviously other art fair, that's my biggest selling opportunity of the year and it only comes around twice. So. Uh, I have ideas for what I want to do and that's why I was talking to my mom because the ceramics did so well last time that I want to do a bigger focus on them instead of having them on a smaller wall. I want them to be like a part of the larger back wall, more pieces, and then have paintings I can show alongside them. So that's going to be a bigger setup too. Um, and these are all ideas and this is stuff that's going to be happening in April and May, but you know, when it comes to the creative process, like I just need to hit the ground running now. So things are ready and then we'll see where it leads us. So that's kind of the update. Um, but I think I'm going to just fix up the studio now and then get back into working on my painting. Let's do it. So this is the mess from yesterday. I shot a sketchbooking video I don't know I was looking back on the footage I thought it was like good but I was like my hands blocking a lot of it and I'm wondering if I bother reshooting it I also worked so late that I had to do this lighting setup which isn't usually my vibe I usually go for natural light but it's just getting so dark so quickly and early. Delta, what are you doing back there? Excuse me. Hey. <laughs> you just helping yourself to the broken ceramics anyway? 
Yeah. Should we get the heat on? It's cold in here. Yeah. Come here. Come on. Yeah. friends it's been a few days since i filmed i don't know why i'm just having like hard time getting back into the mode of vlogging but i will get there i promise today my mom is coming over we're going to work on some ceramics so yeah let me show you what i currently have and then she's bringing over more and we're gonna do that thing where we kind of lay everything out and kind of start making plans um but we are early enough like into this that if you guys didn't get a chance to shop the ceramic shop last time let me know if there's anything that you missed out on that you want because we could potentially add it so let me know let's go see what we have so this is currently what we have like a couple of sort of like these medium-ish size bowls or i don't know maybe that's considered a small bowl what do you think um then this really cute vase um she's already glazed the inside of that and then two more vases and then a couple of big boy vases here i think this one's porcelain but i think the rest is stoneware then i have these planters i didn't get a chance to work on last time but it's pretty neat you screw them to the wall and then you can have like plants spill out over it so I'm excited to work on that there's ornaments but we ain't working on that right now <laughs> we'll leave that for later in the year I also have this piece of clay which potentially might have dried out by now but I was saying to mom how I want like a ceramic um, palette for myself for my paints and so she just brought me this slab that I can work on so we'll see if I can wet it and reactivate it and carve it I don't know, baby's feeling pretty stiff. <laughs> I might have just wasted this clay. We'll see. She's the expert. Um, but yeah, this is what we currently have to work on. And like I said, she's bringing me more. So once she arrives, we'll lay it all out and take a look. And that's for this one, right? Okay. And then chambray for uh, this. Dirty. Dotty. This one's blue lava. Underneath blue lava. Nothing in here. So you're just going to do your, what did you say, the blue? Bon bonsai and blue bonsai. But can I do blue lava for it? Hmm. You think something else? Well, think Hello. about it. If you think there's something else that will go well with blue lava, I'm fine with doing it. I'm just thinking either do your regular black or... Just black? Yeah. Okay, I can do black.
So this is the stuff I have to work on the next few days. I have a plan for everything, which is great. My mom put in the flat colors on a lot of this stuff. It's just me taking the time to do all these little painstaking marks. It takes a long time. Right, Zelda? Mommy's working hard so you can have a luxurious lifestyle. <laughs> all right, guys. I will probably see you tomorrow. Peace. Hello, friends. It's Monday. It is a very dreary rainy day outside so we're always good for that for studio days so i thought i would just fill you in a little bit have a little update this morning before i get into work i've been informed that i have a solo show um at a like larger gallery in new york then um the mural the place that's like having me do it. I, I can't, I feel like I can't talk that much about it yet because like the sketches haven't been approved and stuff, but my assumption that it's going to work out, but basically the place that's like having me do it now they want me to have a show there too. And they want to include ceramics with it. And then like three days ago, I was told that, um, the other art fair LA edition that I got accepted and that that's going to be end of March, beginning of April. So, but they need to know like now whether I'm going to like fly out to LA and do that. So it's kind of like a lot to figure out like, you know, do I actually have enough work to do all of these things? Um, and no matter like how hard I work and like, you know, crank things out, like, is it quality work? Is it stuff I'm proud of? And just trying to like, navigate that um which you know i mean hey i can say these are all good problems to have like i'm very grateful for all the opportunities being provided to me right now especially since like 2020 nothing happened because everything was canceled and then like half of 2021 same thing so i'm happy things are picking back up but um, you know, I had a very successful holiday season and I actually sold some stuff to one of you guys. Thank you viewers, um, over the weekend. So, um, that's some drawings and a ceramic going out. So I literally have one finished ceramic in my studio now. So that's awesome. But that also means there's three shows this spring that want ceramics. And I was speaking to my mom about the kiln and, um, it's like backed up. So uh, I think that's why I'm kind of cranking on ceramics right now because I'm like the earlier I can kind of get that stuff in, it gives it more time for them to get through it because I just know like the kiln's like backed up by a month. And I mean, if I'm going to LA in March, that's like already two months away from now pretty much. So yeah. Um, trying to figure out, can, can I even do it? So I'm going to jump into some work now, think about things, send some emails, and uh, yeah, hopefully by the end of this week, my uh, schedule will be a little bit more clear, but happy Monday, <laughs> let's get into it.
hi, I'm back, it's Tuesday. Yes, I'm wearing the same thing as yesterday. Don't at me. Anyway, um, here's everything I got done. So that's good. Um, but the other thing I have to do is wrap some work to ship, which I've been sending out today. And I do want to put another layer of paint on this painting. So yeah, wrap those pieces, finish this guy, add a layer of paint. That is the minimum to get done today. Let's do it. Okay, change of plans. I am heading to my parents' house because my mom wants to get these into the kiln tomorrow. So I am packed up and going to head down there and bring Miss Zelda. Let's go. Hi friends, really enjoyed eating, blazing at my parents' house. Uh, I was sent back with a few more pieces to work on, but I think I'm just gonna wrap up the video here and I'll see you guys next week. Until then, stay well and stay inspired. Bye.